Hi everybody, Ryan from Vortex Optics here. Welcome to another episode of Rifle Scope 101. Today we're gonna to talk about magnification. How much do you need? Will it help you? Will it hurt you? Common call we get at Vortex. Hey, I just got a new rifle. I wanna put a new scope on it. I need the most magnification, correct? Not necessarily. Balancing act to be struck between optical quantity and optical quality. Deciphering where that line lies can be a little tricky, so let's go over a couple of things. The tendency is to always go higher. What we want to stress to you is that it can be beneficial, but it also comes with a set of detractors that need to be identified. As we go up in magnification, things like image brightness, sharpness, contrast, and clarity will actually go down. And so, say as a hunter, that might not benefit you at all. Even when I'm hunting western states for things like antelope and mule deer, I'm generally tending towards lower magnifications, but higher optical quality. I'm getting the best of both worlds there. I'm able to resolve great detail at great distances, and I'm still getting a very usable power range without having to worry about overdoing my rifle scope and losing things like field of view, brightness, or clarity. Application is, of course, everything. If you're going to be shooting F-Class competition or PRS competition, thousand yard bench rest, certainly going with a low magnification rifle scope might be a bad way to go. Things like our Golden Eagle, this rifle scope is optimized for long range competition at very high magnification. It has the optical quality to match its quantity. Consider that when you're picking up your next high-powered rifle scope. If you're doing close quarters work, three-gun competition, tactical or LE, something like the Razor HD 1-6 to on the vast end of the spectrum uh, is going to give you the best advantage there. One power, extremely wide field of view, very bright, very usable image. Six power, still good intermediate range. You can still engage at distance, but we're not over-choking the rifle. So a couple of the myths perpetuated with magnification is one, it's going to help you see better. Sometimes, not always the case though, you're going to need the optical components and the optical system to match. So best glass, best coatings, best overall design. If it's there, yes, high magnification will certainly do so. The other is that magnification will help you shoot better. That is not always the case. If you've got questions on what optical system, what rifle scope will best suit your application, whether you're hunting, whether you're shooting competitively, whether this is for tactical or LEUs, don't hesitate to give us a call, reach out to us. We're always here to help. Thanks for tuning in, guys. We'll catch you on the next episode of Rifle Scope 101.